Hello, hello everyone! Welcome to my YouTube channel, it's Marta here and we have some art journaling today, yay! And so different on a black gesso, black gesso, uh, doodling, painting. I really hope you will stay and enjoy this spread with me. Uh, we will spend some time together crafting, creating, painting, chatting together. I have to say that working with black gesso is not something I would usually do, it's not something I would usually uh, grab to, but you have challenged me and uh, quite a number of you have mentioned about using black gesso and especially on the art journaling page. So that's what I'm going to do today. We will do some art journaling on black gesso, that's actually my second time and my first time that I ever ever uh, tried uh, working with black gesso was a total fail to the point in my old apartment so that could be five years ago uh, in the old house um, I never showed it to anyone <laughs> I'm working this gorgeous gorgeous beautiful uh, journal that I uh, got as a gift so thank you so 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 much uh, a gift from a friend uh, from a lovely lady who's watching uh, my videos what I love about this is that it lays flat because I'm using books, most of them, or all of them, they never flat. This one, anywhere I open, it flattens. It's like a sketchbook more and more than anything. But it's absolutely amazing. I love, love, love my cover. It has lots of pages. There are some brown as well and creamy ones. It's not thick paper though. So, last night, because I meant to record last night but I didn't, time went away somewhere. I glued two pages here together and two pages here together so that's that's a big help. Now what I'm gonna do is I will grab my... Uh, I'm gonna cover the whole page black basically uh, because yeah I have no plan what we're gonna do and I have to tell you this is challenging for me for definite. I brought uh, the white ink because I have a feeling that maybe black and white kind of could be good so what I'm gonna do is I am gonna just this is quite stiff brush I don't like that so I'm gonna grab maybe something else uh, oh yeah that's much better so I'm gonna just apply my black gesso I wonder should I apply everywhere or just in partials like everywhere or just I don't know maybe just a bit no actually maybe maybe you know what maybe this time we do it all ladies and gentlemen we do it all all the way Please don't move. It's okay. <laughs> um, it's a challenge for definite. Uh, I have. I didn't. I don't think I've seen many uh, YouTube or any projects done on black gesso with, when it comes to art journaling. Hmm, that's interesting, isn't it? Uh, but I think maybe it's time to challenge ourselves. I th I'm thinking about some abstract. I'm thinking about yeah, some abstract probably. Looking good, isn't it? <laughs> good for a good start. Nice for a good start. Um, yeah. <laughs> I cannot believe I'm doing it because I would probably be the first to kind of skip it and walk away from the black kind of art journaling subject. But I really had few of you mentioning that recently. And then when someone mentioned it, I saw that many of you have liked that comment. I was asking you somewhere in my Facebook uh, what would you like to see and someone said black gesso journaling and many of you have liked that comment so that indicate me indicates me that okay <laughs> okay Marta you're not gonna escape that this time uh, they want it so plus I really wish uh, to bring you something different and that's definitely something we've never done before so here it is black gesso over now can you use black acrylics I'd say yes I would imagine yes the, the one that I've done last time, uh, last and the only time, like five years ago, it was a black page, not a gesso at all. It was just black page journal, <laughs> I think. Or maybe I paint, I can't remember, but it was disaster. Okay, let's dry that now. Okay, so the pages are dry. They are shiny. My gesso is shiny. And, uh, I'm not sure if any ever gesso is like that. This one seems to be kind of is shiny. I don't know if this is still white. Oh, it's still wet. Okay, so we can do some stamping. My plan is to do some stamping and I have some stamps here. I think this is pretty interesting set. And those are some kind of bubbles and circles and all. I think this could be nice to stamp. 
No, I think I will need a block for sure. I'll try to use the block maybe. Mm -hmm. Now I think I'm gonna go for just random really oops okay mm, okay maybe I need a bit more that's okay that's okay no panic maybe I need a little bit more ink I just want to see how much I, it's still there maybe not much maybe I do need new ink and re-inking that I'm just using my white ink for the nearly first time or second time so possibly possibly it's yeah it's dry I think someone said to me that you have to re-ink that regularly when you every time you use it I think I heard so um, I understand at least then you will have amazing I think it was this that much I should. Uh, at least you will have every time beautiful image and so on. I don't know. I'll see if this will be any better. I think so. Right away. Even more. White. Oh, do you see? That's perfect. So I'm thinking to add to make the, oops the whole page kind of like this. Lovely, with <clears throat> with all kinds of shapes and yeah, I have some other stamps here. This one is from 49 and Market actually, and they have those gorgeous bubbles that I like, and I really wish to use it. Oops. Ugh. Okay, there we go. So let's see. Okay, I think that works well. Ooh. Wow, <laughs> it's certainly very sticky all together. Everything here is extremely sticky. Am I pressing too hard? Possibly, I'm pressing too hard. Anyway, okay. <laughs> um, what else we have? Some other cute circles and stuff. So I'll use that. Mm -hmm. So I'm stamping with white, but I'm gonna finish off the whole the whole page with colors. I hope that's the plan anyway, and with some more abstract. But yeah, uh, you'll see. Well, I don't. I, I I'm just guessing what to do, but you will see what I mean when I say all kinds of abstracts. Oh, that's lovely, actually. Mm -hmm. Oops, how about here? Okay. Now, what else we have? We have the small one. Or this one, or this one, or this one, or this one, or... We try again this one. How about if I just use my fingers? Will that be any better at all, or what? Maybe like this. Yeah, that's nice. I like that. It doesn't have to be perfect because we will be still covering that. I will take the small one here, which is nice. We will be using, we will be, co oops, <laughs> that's okay. We will be covering that with, uh, with circles, I think. So my plan is to build up the background right now with stamps and with circles and dots and maybe text or something and then make kind of um, stamp some bigger circles and then trace around it with color that's that's at least what's in my head but again <laughs> um, I think I need something else, something different maybe this or not, that's already used I'm afraid to use dirty stamps on my on my uh, white ink. Oh, this could be nice. This could be nice. I like it. Mm -hmm. How cool is this? So feel free to use any stamps, guys, you have. Oh, that's nice. Everything is so sticky. <laughs> I like that. 
it's like a this totally um, abstractish feel to it, isn't it? I love it. Okay, I'm gonna leave this. Uh, I'm gonna take back again this stamp here and maybe stamp it kind of more randomly, I guess. Uh, I think what's nice is this one, so I'm going to go back to this one because I think it's super cute stamp and it could be used more than once. Okay, that's nice, I like that. We have also this stamp here, with, is it hello? I think it's kind of like hello. <coughs> That's fine. Mm -hmm. Now, what could we do instead of stamp? We could do a bit of doodling. I'll actually do a little. We'll do a little bit of doodling. Let's see if I have my maybe white posca. That that it works. That works. Let's see if I have it. I do. Oops. So white posca and. I need some bit of paper to try my Posca. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's very white, isn't it? And that's super nice. I like that. Maybe we can exactly doodle around those what we have right now that looks already kind of like um what's the word like kind of sky ish thing i like that i think it's nice mm -hmm. i'm a mad person about dots dots and spots and butterflies those are my kind of things <laughs> Again, you can doodle however you like, whatever feels great for for you. Now, Hannah had her injection today and she's asleep now, so that's why out of nowhere I decided I'm gonna go quickly jump in and record something. Because I had a plan last night, but I was busy with finishing a project which is hugely important to me, which I will tell you soon. Sorry for teasing you all the time. I cannot say much. I can't tell you that. Uh, you will love it, I hope. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, soon. I really, I really hope soon. Okay. So yes, last night I went to. I meant to record. All I managed to do is <laughs> glue pages together. Okay, I love that now. How about you? You like that? You think it's nice? You could easily doodle away things, you know, just like... So now, my next idea, I think, is to grab some bigger, um, like, oh, like this. Maybe this will be actually perfect. This, and I'm thinking to make a few circles, so whatever it's inside will stay. And we paint around, around it, so let's see. I'm gonna grab some white Posca here. That's a little too small, but that's okay. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna um, dab it here. I could probably just do it directly, couldn't I? Anyway, okay, I think that's nice. You can try to. Oh, super, nice. Let's do one more circle. Maybe like here. Super. What about smaller size? What about like this size? I can probably just paint over it, can't I? I think so. Okay. Hmm, where is nice? <laughs> where is nice thing? Wow, it's difficult to pick. Maybe like that. 
oh guys it's gonna be amazing I'm telling you now I'm gonna do the, the big one first I love this jar it's from actually coconut oil I use it uh, I try to use more of that than the regular oil just healthier I think I don't know much about it but I'm trying to learn it learn about it okay where else we can I think it will make mm, more sense kind of here okay and then one more metal and maybe we try to do something like extremely smaller than that and we need for this to dry okay hmm I think this could be nice here oops oopsie that's okay one more and that would be it and then maybe maybe slightly smaller size as well mm -hmm. I don't know maybe maybe here Lucas is going to pick up Emily from school I think because it's school time pick up collection time and she had a um, school tour today so she was extremely happy well kind of school tour not really school tour but yeah oh I forgot about this stamp I meant to do some flowers as well oh well is it too late I'll see I'll see if it's too late. Probably it's too late, but it's okay. Maybe here? Oh, that's so pretty. It's not too late, guys. Look. It's never too late. <laughs> Let's see. Very pretty, so 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 much delicacy in here. I like that very much. Oh wow! Now that is gorgeous. <clears throat> Oops. Maybe one more here. I love it guys I really truly love it I have no idea what directions we're going here and I'm pretty <laughs> scared to be honest because yeah I am I be honest I am scared if this is gonna be looking like really just wrong altogether okay oh one more here maybe okay okay not perfect acceptable <laughs> so now we need some colors guys we need some colors to paint it over around the black I think black circles okay so I have those gorgeous Jane Davenport paints why not to try and use them all how about that so I will just gently play around now maybe I'll add color here and there okay we have some blue there are <clears throat> I just checked camera if I'm actually recording <laughs> okay yeah this one was the one that didn't want to squirt out that's okay okay uh -huh. if any of your tubes is kind of broken-ish you can put tape. Uh, on top of that it should help it should help that's what I did with mine because it's just a common thing that what happens with those paints um, yeah they they knew that they are faulty afterwards they realized it and tried to replace it and fix it and all so okay let's see where are we going with this I'm actually <laughs> scared I am okay I'm gonna leave this one as well. Wow, I'm going into some kind of strange direction with it here. But 
I'm not sure I like the the <clears throat> idea of strokes with my brush. Maybe I just paint away with my fingers. I think so. I start liking it. I really do. It's like in kindergarten, guys. Uh, like, trace the shape. <laughs> trace the shape. Oh, I love it. I like the fact that they are. Oh, is it? They not opaque? Is it? They have translucent. They like. You know, I like that. I like that because you can see through actually some things, which is nice. It's it's actually nice. Wow. I am. <laughs> I'm kind of surprised myself what direction this goes. I'm I'm really liking it. I really am enjoying this and liking this. So okay. Wow. Oh, that's so nice. You know, <clears throat> I'm gonna put that back. It's so nice to feel that something is actually nice. It can work. I'm gonna add one more color. Say so why not? And we have one more here. I think that's different yellow, or is it the same yellow? that I just opened. Do I have exactly the same two paints? How is that possible even? Hmm. It looks like it. <laughs> okay. I don't know how. I have no clue how this happened. Yeah, use your fingers, guys. Guys and girls and boys and... <laughs> uh, yeah. I, I'm really happy with it, guys. I, I, was, I was afraid. I really was I was afraid it's I like the semi transparency of it it's like a little bit like a galaxy -ish kind of or am I wrong but a little bit and you can see through I love that idea I really love the idea of see peeking through and you know what you don't have to maybe go everywhere just in in moments like as in maybe not everywhere on the on the edges I don't know I'll I'll see where my fingers will take me but it certainly is something nice and interesting. A, a technique that uh, I'm sure I have seen something similar somewhere because, yeah. <laughs> uh, but I was just thinking, what can I do with black gesso? Black gesso. But there is obviously so much you can do, but it's just, I think, to break the black, the, the black gesso fear. Oh, that's how I can title the, the video. How to break a black gesso fear. <laughs> I think so because you know I think many of us have purchased certain products and you just you are afraid to use it for various reasons but yeah you just sometimes don't know how to use it you're scared of destroying your beautiful project and yeah I love that wow I am loving it now you will say to me what's the point of stamping all over oh well you don't you, when you stamp when you do things you don't know what kind of direction it will go you just don't know we don't know everything guys and that's the beauty of it you know i'm just thinking that i need oops i need that little flower there on the white circle on the small circle that i left kind of accidentally <laughs> nice Nice! Although I have a little bit of paint here. <laughs> That's okay. I have to say I'm totally loving that. I will fix it in terms of making sure that we have all nice and, um, you know, like finishing touches and all. We'll do that. But it does look very good to me. It really is different. It's It's nice. You know me, when I'm scared, I tell you. <laughs> and I was kind of like, okay. <laughs> but, yeah. Oh, I love that. It's so nice. And if if I'm copying someone by accident, honestly, please forgive me if if the credit should be given here. I just I just came up with this kind of myself. It's not nothing original uh, to cover partials and all. But, yeah. I just, I just don't know. I didn't see, um, I didn't see black gesso kind of working like that. But maybe I'm wrong. And if I'm wrong, please, please, you can always tell me. I love that. 
I really really am loving that. I love the fact that now you can play nicely with the color and you can just um, I don't know just m blend them and mix them and make nice shading shading and wow wow I'm really wow mm, wow <laughs> all I can say is wow okay let's dry that and come back to you back to you a uh, courier came so I had to open a box and <laughs> let me show you beautiful beautiful rice paper soon on my Remy small art.com on my website you have to have a look at those only few designs to show you there's like 20 times more different designs so this week I'll be adding those to the shop so definitely check it out and those are cheaper than the previous one I try to find something that it's not as expensive as the the other papers so I hope that this will be helpful for those who really wish to have art journaling with some decoupage mixed together using rice paper so I hope that uh, you will be happy with those it's gonna be set of five different or ten definitely not per page because it's too expensive to ship one to be honest because I buy special envelopes for it those who purchase already uh, my rice paper you will know that um, even envelope uh, there is a proper beautiful brown envelope you can even use it again uh, so yes I, I will be setting sets of five pieces or ten pieces uh, but gorgeous gorgeous mm, I'm too excited not to show you look at those absolutely loving it loving it loving it some other and there is more 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 it's only few for you to see. I just cannot wait to show you and share it. Look at the gorgeous birdies. So lovely for art journaling projects. So yes, coming soon to the shop. I just looked at my phone. Uh, it, the whole phone is kind of galaxy color. And uh, my 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 holder, my, my thing that I hold my phone is galaxy. So that's why it kind of reminded me here. But anyway. I have those pens and yet again it's a beautiful gift from a friend from Cynthia so thank you thank you so much and I was thinking to doodle a little bit and opposite to it let's do the black on, on the color and um, don't worry Hannah is perfectly fine but she certainly would love to be here which cannot be possible always <laughs> so I'll see if I can doodle away on top of those paints yeah it does work perfect so really you can technically uh, add any sort of shape any sort of color whatever rocks you both whatever feels comfortable with you you know and I think doodling is really relaxing my card memory was full so I had to I had to put it in the computer I had something else on that card anyway let's keep on doodling a little bit just a little bit there's so much you can do when it comes to doodles really possibilities are endless can you hear the little tiger <laughs> Hannah is like a little tiger ah. Ah. yeah that's what I was afraid of that I may you know it's the those paints are kind of chalky and the, my my am I off camera no sorry and my pen is writing very well on it but you, you may be careful those are I've never used those those are called graphics line marker I have to say I'm really grateful for having so many friends who are willing to send me things thank you so much I I never know what to say and it's hard to re re receive gifts isn't it I, I'm much better in giving than receiving, to be honest. But I'm always very happy and grateful, so thank you so much. Now, what else we can do here? We could actually do like this. Finish off. 
<clears throat> uh, I'm also tempted to do a little bit of good link with white, I think, will be nice. I'm, sh I'm sure. I told you this t ton tons times, didn't I, that Hannah is such a chatty box, I mean, in her own language, she still, we speak both to her, English and Polish, so I think that could slow it down a little bit, her kind of, <laughs> not speaking, but speaking with sense, I guess. <laughs> she is doughty, I have to say. She's great, a little monkey. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna black that all. You see, I'm not a doodler, but I am enjoying doodling. I really am and I think it mat it's a matter of practice you can actually find doodle art and doodle tips and tricks and lines and how people doodle uh, so yes there's this whole section of doodling in general which I think it's amazing I wish to have the talent I wish but I think with time we just have to we can just learn things I guess now what about a little bit of rectangle not rectangles like triangles here little bit of triangles. I wonder if this is still a recording. It is... I think I had quite a, a long break from videos, didn't I? I think more than usually. Uh, but yeah, I'm still <laughs> busy. <laughs> busy, busy, busy. We were very busy with the shop after opening. Many, many of you have uh, purchased things, so thank you so much. Um, so yeah. We were packing and shipping and sending and ah, oh, it was crazy I have to say, crazy few days and I'm still working on my secret project so yeah, Easter is approaching, many exciting things though. What about this one, what could we, what could we do here, how about, I don't know, I don't know, but how, what about if I do like lines, just lines, like a line, like just lines and then maybe we do some we're gonna join it with something I don't know like a sun but not really I have to say those markers are fantastic those liners I cannot hear the family someone is upstairs maybe Emily is gone with Hannah upstairs oh no they on the corridor you know the mother instinct that you don't hear the child and you, it starts to worrying you more than when you hear the bang. <clears throat> Hannah is very adventurous. Fearless, adventurous. Yeah. Good fun though. But, yeah. <laughs> what? Else? Oh, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do little hearts here. On every second one, maybe. I think that could be nice. Oh, that's so cute now. Little hearts. Heart there. Heart there. I hope you are encouraged to try it. Because this is such a fun technique, I think. And it's really easy. It really is easy. So don't wait. Grab your art journal. And just do some magic with it. Okay. Promise me that. Promise me that. Okay, maybe like this. I'm gonna make it a bit bigger here. A little bit bigger. We have chicken soup today. Emily's favorite one. And it turns that Hannah's too. Okay, back to you. Emily was whispering because she brought me leggings from upstairs and she, d <laughs> she didn't want to say it out loud. Yes. Uh, sometimes when I'm back home, well I always when I'm back home I really love to get changed and I didn't do it because Hannah was asleep so I wanted to really record super fast so yes but then sitting in a jeans it's not so great so anyway uh, I'm thinking to add a little bit more of the white or you know what I have them chalk markers do you remember those I'll see if, if this is any good if I can do something with those markers Hmm. I actually wonder, is, is, is this kind of art something that you like? Is this something, you know, this type of art journaling, is, is this is in your liking, I wonder? No, I don't like the tip of that for this type of works. I'm gonna stick with the white for now. 
at least uh, I'm gonna color in those little hearts and if you'll be asking this is uni Posca Posca pen uh, white and you can have different thickness I'm looking in my in my in my white uh, container with my white Posca oh that's the thinner Posca I think am I right yes so this one is thinner one maybe I'll use that in a second actually what I love about Posca is the coverage it's unbeatable coverage for making dots and yeah no it's fabulous it really is fabulous I love making splashes with it as well and it's a, a must product for me since very long time actually very very long time indeed I'm sure that you heard about me using Posca pen for a for very long for like for always since since always sorry since always You have to shake it well. Uh, shake it, shake it. It's very interesting, um, very interesting project for me, to be honest, because yeah, it's just a color, color um, art journaling with black jets. So uh, many ma ma years ago now, not that many, sometimes ago, my YouTube channel was filled with art journaling like this, colored art journaling. I wonder if you like them projects, if you, if this is something in your liking, because I didn't do them for very long, but I think it's nice to be back, it's nice to be back for sure. Okay, I like that. I love dots in all kinds, so, no, this should be like that. Okay, what else we can do? We can bring that standing out even more, I think. I'm turning my uh, my 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 journal around because I don't want like I'm left-handed. It's hard for me to not smudge it. So I'm sorry if I am in your way in looking what I'm doing. I hope it's not too difficult to watch it because I'm just up. Up with my hand so I won't touch the you know what I mean <laughs> now I'm, I'm tempted to do something here I ju I'm just not too sure what to do um, but I'm tempted to do something here I think it would be lovely to 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 do it what maybe like this actually like this, like a flower maybe. Yeah, like a petal flower. Flower, petals. Yes, that will be nice, I think. Okay, so let's do that if this will allow me to... Yeah, that's what I don't like sometimes. But it is actually... Is it because of my... Because of my... Uh, the paint is dry, so it should be fine. I guess. Yeah, making a flower from that will be awesome. Look at that, guys. You see, sometimes you just have to move it around and it back again. It, it, it's back again and it writes. Lovely. Like this. Uh -huh. Like that. I hope you can see that, guys. I really do. Oh, I had the plan for the butterfly. Maybe I'll still use it. I think it will be still nice. So. I hear some family gossips, not gossips, whispers happening there. Hannah is happily playing around. One, two, two. One, two, two. One, two, two. My doodling is not perfect. I know that. I do. But, you know, like, it, it's not the perfection that matters. Quite opposites. Bless you, Hannah. It's, it's actually about the the beauty of trying, of creative process, of learning, of experimenting, exploring and so on and so on. I encourage you to try. Your first step is to try and to be fearless, to trust your instinct that you can do it. You really can. Everyone can. How is that? I love it. I love it. Okay. Now it would be lovely if I could actually fill that in with the color. How about the yellow one? I think this could be 
totally awesome. Yes! If this will actually work. It will. Even just a bit. Even just a bit. Oh, I love that now. How I bought those in uh, Eason. That's our kind of in Ireland shop. I'm not sure it's anywhere else, but it was a fourteen dollar, fourteen euro down to three euro, which makes it roughly three and a half dollars from fifteen dollars to three and a half. Unbeatable uh, earth colors, unbeatable, unbeatable price. Honestly, so I bought it for price. I wasn't sure if I'd be using it, how good or bad they are. I thought, you know what, for this price, it cannot be that bad. And now I'm so happy I can actually use it. So yes. It reminds me of one video that Emily recently recorded. She did this fun, uh, she did so many videos, I just didn't have chance to upload them. Um, if you don't know that Emily has her own YouTube channel, check it out. It's called Emily's Small World. And she has some crafty videos there. I'm sure there will be some more coming, but summertime probably when there's not not much school. The poor baby had uh, she had confirmation this year. Uh, she ha she still does p two schools, Polish and Irish one. So you know she's a busy little girl, uh, my little teenager. So yes, recording videos is really on the side, like a little pl pleasure for her. A little she's something she really loves, but. Yeah, I don't want her to be, you know, feeling that she has to record and all of that. One thing that I've noticed, this is not drying. I don't know why, but I'm going to heat it up and try to dry it, basically. So hopefully this will dry, but it's very strange it doesn't want to dry. Is it because of the surface being... but surface is chalky surface, I don't know. Is this... those are chalk markers. Maybe it's because they should be on the... they are like washable. I'll see what happens, you know, if I have to wash it off, that's okay, that's what we're going to do. But I believe they will eventually dry, no? I would imagine they will dry eventually. I, do you know what I would love? I tell you a little dream of mine. I really would love Posca pen to have in all colors they have. But Posca is quite, pretty expensive, I cannot afford it. So that's why I keep on having only white color. But someday I hope to do it, because... Imagine if, if this would be Posca now, all of that doodling in Posca would be phenomenal, isn't it? And yeah, I can hear the chats. I wonder if you can hear the chats from the kitchen, <laughs> from the kitchen coming. So I'm nearly done. It's actually kind of drying. It's, it's slowly drying. Uh, you probably would tell me, oh, Marta, you could skip that part and just, you know that if you bored if I'm talking too much, if it's like too long for you, you can fast forward the video, there's this button um, on the video that you can just make it speed it twice, speed it twice, so use that button guys if you feel like you need to speed it or I chat if you're bored, I completely understand it, but you know, it's up to you, that's what I'm trying to say. Um, I could certainly speed it up, but at the same time, you, I still have to do it, so I may as well chat to you and do it. <laughs> okay, I love that. It's gorgeous. So I'm thinking to add uh, the blue one, maybe, just a little bit on those, around it, on those tiny petals, if this will work. Yeah, a little bit. It's really fabulous how the colors, how the colors are here. So, yeah. I like that very much. Okay, I I'm just adding those tiny petals. I hope you can see them. If it's not too boring, but it's beautiful to see it coming to life. How to break a black blank page. <laughs> That's what I'm going to title it. Blank page but in black. Maybe this journal will be all in black. How about that? I have to say I was apprehensive. I was not sure. I was like, okay, Marta, just do it. Just get over with it. Just have it done. They ask for it. You ask what they want. They said it to you. Why don't you just do it? So I said, okay, fine. And I was hoping that this is going to be a quick video, which now I see it's not. <laughs> because you can do so much more. Oh, look at that absolutely stunning isn't it am I upside down where's my 
yeah was it like that I think it doesn't matter to be honest I wonder if that butterfly at all works and matches or is it a bit too much um, I think to match them both I will add those blue here as well so this big one will match this big one will match with this big one and I think it would be just nice my white one from here, from top, is disappearing, so I have to redo that. Those are nice markers too, I have to say, if they dry properly, because I don't know if they will. Now, I need to add this white. Maybe I need way more ink. Ugh. Sometimes that's what happens, you need a bit more ink to make it more white. Uh-huh. Ta -da. <laughs> Ta -da. Coo -coo. I love that. I love that. I love, love, love that. Now I'm thinking, what about. Am I. No. I can do a little bit of yellow here, maybe. Just touches. Just. Oh, I know what it looks like. You know what colors it reminds me? It reminds me of bubbles, really colored bubbles when you have like a li washing liquid and it just this color on the black. I should try that, redo uh, do that. Oh, nice guys, look at this. Oh wow. I love it. A touch of color, sure, why not? Oh wow, okay, what about the blue, the green one? I think we are done. I'm afraid to kind of in anyhow destroy it, so I'm gonna be packing my, my toys guys now and finishing because it's beautiful as it is and let's not let's not destroy it in any way because it's beautiful. It really is. It speaks to me very much. Although, I didn't guess it, how it's gonna be. It's nice. Wow. I wonder about the butterfly, or is it too much with the butterfly, or is it just not matching? I don't know. Let me see. Like this, like here. Or maybe I just this time will have no butterflies. Or, I'm always tempted to have butterflies. Oh, the little dotties here around. The small dotties because of the small Posca. Oh, that's nice. That's nice as well. Cute, 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 cute. When Hannah sees the cat, she's calling for cat. We have a neighbor cat that comes to our garden regularly, so she jumps in right to the window to see the cat and she goes She's so hilarious. Okay. I love that now. How how do you like the fact that the black is inside? I think this is cool effect for sure. Now either we're gonna add some title or butterfly or something. Yes, decision made. I'm gonna add some stickers and yet again shine. I'm gonna add the stickers that are mine, <laughs> that I totally love and adore. Uh, so shine can be here. Enjoy the happy accident. It wasn't pure accident, but in a way, I think yeah. Uh, my art, my art therapy. I love my titles. I can only tell you a little secret that new stickers are coming soon. So yes, let's sp spill the beans for new secret, for a little secret. So new st new stickers are coming soon, I hope. So yeah, I cannot wait actually. I will be still using those because those are gorgeous no matter what. Let me grab the bigger one. Okay, we have Inspire. Now the stickers in, in uh, those that I'm using, you can find them in my store, of course. But also, um, there are four different, just so you know. And don't, don't forget to check the new shop, because my old shop is kind of slowly closing. So the, the new shop has all the products, everything. Creative Mess, I like that. 
Uh, I'm using this uh, this thing, this. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't want to say it badly, so I say I forgot again. But this helps to get rid of the bubble, the the, the the air from underneath it. So honestly, I think this is so amazing right now. Life is a journey, guys. Life is a journey. Oh no, creative madness, creative mess. I love, love, love it. Finally, I can add my title. I don't know if I'll have added it anywhere before. Ah, sometimes you may have troubles to unstick it, kind of, but that's okay, guys. It will be fine. Uh, it just that's how it comes sometimes. It's nothing old, bad, or anything. Oh, it's just that's how it comes. Okay, I love, 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 love it. One on top of another. That's okay. I love it. I love, love, love it, you know my saying? Because <laughs> one of them is small whispers. It's my things I said. There you go, go for it, be proud of your art. Why not? It's up to yourself. Stop hiding, just try it. Just start a blank, blank page. All you need is good hearts. And love, love, love it, and a few more. Yeah, I encourage you to check it out. It's perfect for art journaling. Just do it, yeah? There you go. Just do it. I really hope you will break a blank, black, blank, black, blank page. <laughs> If you tell me it's too many of the stickers, I don't care because I think it's amazing. I think it's amazing and it's so busy and it's so different and it's so challenging and inspiring at the same time. I'm happy! Yay! I'm happy, I'm happy. Now, some, some bit of splashes if I... Oh, there we go. Just few. Not too much, not too many. There we go. Justice. I'm done. And I'm totally happy, totally proud of this. How do you like it? How do you like that? So different. I think I'm going to keep the whole journal like this, as in very flat. Yes. Yeah, so, guys, I hope you liked it, enjoyed it, and for a definite, please, 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 let me know what you think. Let me know your thoughts about it. I would love to hear from you, as always. Thank you so much. Pleasure to be in your homes. Pleasure to be able to chat to you. Uh, and I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope it was inspirational and you will uh, try it yourself. Because that's the main thing. Try it for yourself. You will really love it. I promise you. So, thank you so much. Uh, let me know in the comments uh, down below under the video your thoughts about it. And yeah, and I'll talk to you very, very soon. Bye. Bye-bye. Back to you for just two seconds. I was taking a photograph and I think that the butterfly is gonna stay there. I like it like that. Have a look. No butterfly? Very pretty. With butterfly? Double the pretty, I think. So yeah, butterfly has to stay, I think. Well, or it could be double-sided tape so it can be there. doesn't have to. <laughs> uh, anyway, I'll talk to you soon guys. Bye! Happy crafting!